Growing up, when your mom and dad don't speak English, you have to do everything for them. I can't even do my homework. I'm filling out disability forms. Felipe, you're one of my um, idols. Curious, what shampoo do you use, man? Because. <laughs> It's funny you ask that. People ask that after the show, Felipe, what kind of shampoo you use? I don't know, man. I got it from the salon. I think the sign that said, um, sample, don't take. <laughs> but this week, I'm using um, Hilton. Hilton? Well, that's the hotel I'm staying Ah, oh, that's the hotel. That's the hotel. All right. I've been translating my whole life. English to Spanish, Spanish to English. I'd rather be bisexual than bilingual. How does that kid from East LA here now? How did that happen? Well, first of all, for people who are watching me right now, and they're gonna be saying, Felipe not from East LA. He's from Boyle Heights, which I, I I grew up in Boyle Heights. Just to let people know, man, people start complaining. <laughs> I used to live in a housing projects of Pico Gardens, Pico Aliso, Aliso Village. There were like three housing projects, no, four housing projects from 1st Street in a real one mile square area and there were like 11 gangs. Like, there was one gang when I opened my door to the living room and there was another gang in the back kitchen. So I couldn't like, I had to make pee, I have to go out the front all the time because I didn't get along with the gang in the kitchen. So, <laughs> so I always wanted to be a comedian. My friend Jackie, he introduced me to Bill Cosby's record and he put in one of those you know, the little ones, the little suitcase ones. Yeah. And I fell in love with the comedy. Then I, I, I heard uh, Richard Pryor in high school. And then I then um, I saw Paul Rodriguez and Born East LA. And, and when I saw Paul Rodriguez, I was like, this guy I can relate to. It was like, it was the way Afri African Americans look at, Paul, at Richard Pryor as the king. Um, to me, Paul Rodriguez was gonna be the king of comedy for me because I knew what he was talking about. Like, I knew what the other community were talking about, but it was a little personal. And Paul Rodriguez, like, he made it personal for me. 